Hi everyone, my name is Erin and I apologize if I do not have a working camera on my laptop, um, but I do fairly look like this picture. <laughs> it's only from a year ago. <laughs> um, I am born and raised in Long Beach and have tried to move away several times, but fate kept bringing me back, so I think I'm here to stay. Um, this is actually my first experience at Cal State Long Beach. I got my undergrad from a smaller private school 20 years ago, and that undergrad was in social science with an emphasis in political science. Uh, as I said, I am born and raised Long Beach. I love to spend time with my kids outside, um, doing fun things that, whether it's the city offers or just our local community, I think there's so many beautiful and wonderful things to explore in the area. So, um, you know, just last summer, we've done Yosemite, we've gone to the Sequoias, we did Mammoth. That's my dog sinking in the snow because we were in Mammoth during the middle of a snowstorm actually a blizzard. And uh, yeah, we love biking around, going to the beach, um, playing all the sports and doing all the things. Um, whenever I'm not working, I always want to be outside. I feel so lucky that we live in a place where we can do that. So I really try to take full advantage of it. Uh, I have a paddle board, so I'm often down at the beach at the bay right here doing some paddling. Um, a lot of swimming. My son, my younger son, is a junior lifeguard, so I tried to do a lot of competition with him to support him. Um, this year we did the Iron Guard together, and we finished. We did it last year, and we didn't finish, so this year we finished. And if you don't know what the Iron Guard is, you start at 70, or sorry, First Street in downtown Long Beach, and you end up all the way at the other end of Long Beach at 72nd at the end of the peninsula, and it's a mixture of running and swimming. You swim out to 16 buoys and then run, so I believe it's four miles of running and two miles of swimming. Um, I'm also an avid hiker and backpacker, so um, most of my experiences have been fairly local in, in nearby states, but as my kids get older and maybe my bank account gets bigger, I can afford to, to be doing some more adventuring. But yes, I love to be off grid and um, hike with my friends. Uh, I've been in the nonprofit industry pretty much my whole career, so about 20 years. Uh, most of my experience has been working with the unhoused and children experiencing poverty and homelessness. Um, I'm really proud of the work that I've done. A lot of it's been local right here in Long Beach or in nearby communities. So, um, you know, I've, I've participated in lots of fundraisers. I've spoken on panels. I'm also a mentor. Um, I'm very involved in Leadership Long Beach, which is an organization that um, brings in people from the city, from civic and public and private sector to take a 10-month leadership course. So I did the course about five, six years ago, and now I'm on the board and also act as a mentor there. And lastly, because I have so much experience in the nonprofit industry, I would love to study one that I'm not too familiar with, which is the Conservation Corps of Long Beach. I've been lucky enough to do some partnering with them over the years years and I know they're a great organization, but I do not know a lot about their ins and outs and how they receive their funding. All right. Thank you so much. Look forward to this class. Bye.